For Best Buy backlash, an employee is sharing his frustration after store managers made him remove his Black Lives Matter mask. Face coverings are mandatory, but the social message is apparently too controversial. NBC4's Gordon Togumatsu spoke with a worker who is now taking a stand. Andrew Payne says he wasn't trying to cause any trouble when he first put the mask on. When I put it on, it doesn't pinch my ears down so my glasses don't fall off. But that was before managers here at the Empire Center Best Buy store pulled him aside. He's worked here for five years, he told us. Here's what he says the general manager told him that day, July 1st. We don't want to have any safety issues and uh, you should, like it would be best if you don't wear the mask. Uh, Tomorrow. But as he headed back to his job in the store's warehouse, that statement started to bother him. He looked around and saw a flyer informing everyone that a most patriotic mask contest was underway. The winner gets a Starbucks card. Other people around the building were wearing other masks that had like sports teams and all kinds of different designs. Payne's sister, Alexis, puts it this way. I don't think that saying my life matters, you know, Black Lives Matter, is that controversial? The best thing I could do is, is, you know, stand up for what I believe in. We reached out to Best Buy's corporate headquarters, which sent us a statement. It says other employees have also expressed a desire to use their face masks for social or political statements. But the company says while we love the passion those requests frequently represent, our country is deeply divided, and those divisions sometimes spill over into anger and even violence. Andrew says he was given an option after his discussion with his supervisor, either wear another mask or don't come to work. For now, he's chosen not to come to work. If you believe in something, stand up for it. Gordon Tokumatsu, NBC4 News.